Welcome to another edition of the Nightly Nuge. And Ted, you have a wonderful award right there. Uh, why don't you tell us what we're looking at there before we get into the topic of the week? Well, let's get into a uh, celebratory, let's say, braggadocio moment, because my name is Ted Nugent, <laughs> and I've been raising hell for at least the last 60. I was defiant against the beatniks and the hippies and stupid and drugs and alcohol and tobacco and stupid food and the anti-hunting scam of animal rights. So I've always had a middle finger on fire because it, with all sincerity, that was all that was a cute little soliloquy, soliloquy there. But God gave me the gift of defiance. And when I saw the first threats of political correctness, and I was being literally attacked and condemned because I wouldn't snort cocaine with the industry people. I mean, they, they tried to peer pressure me. But I, like the song says, they hadn't invented peer pressure yet. It seems I stood alone. So I was always a critical thinker. And I think finally, after 28 years, what an honor. Uh, Keith, you have to admit we've talked about this. To be voted by the greatest humans in the world, those would be the Second Amendment demanders at the National Rifle Association to be voted on with the highest votes in the history of the NRA many, many times uh, for 28, almost 29 years. That is an indicator why Michael Moore can't stand me, which is also an indicator why I got this award from President Donald Trump, the guy who brought the, the lowest unemployment in the history, the cleanest air, soil and water, the lowest crime rate, a uh, secure border, uh, got us out of global contracts where hardworking American families' tax dollars had to be spent for Bangladesh, you know, in and, and, and Vietnam, uh, environmental pollution. We could go on. But this was given to me by the great President Donald Trump. And it says right here, the Great American Defender of Freedom Award, American Freedom Tour, Ted Nugent. And so I am accepting this, Keith, on behalf of you, because you're a freedom fighter. And my entire team, my wife, Shemaine, my kids who stand up against the lie, the scam, the joke of peer pressure. God made us individuals. So here at the Nightly Nuge, I accept this on behalf of everybody watching and celebrating the Nightly Nuge, where truth, logic, and common sense is the wind beneath the eagle's wings. And if we don't fight against evil, if I'm not into politics, you are literally fueling evil. In 2022, if you're not against the Nancy Pelosi's and the Joe Bidens and the Hunter Bidens and the Eric Holders and the Barack Obamas and the Hillary Clintons, if you're not against them, then Satan, and this is harsh, harsh terminology, if you're with the Democrats and you think men should destroy the hard-earned world athletic records of women— and if you think that fat, perverted, satanic men should be able to crotch twerk children at a at a drag queen event, it, then you're on the side of evil. You have to be into politics. So I accept this on behalf of working hard, playing hard Americans who take risks, make sacrifices and participate in this sacred, unique experiment in self-government, because it says American Freedom Tour, Defender of Freedom. If you're not defending freedom, Paul Pelosi would like to join you to hide the hammer some evening. So, Keith, thank you for all your efforts. I share this award with you because I don't do it alone. I do it with people who are brave and courageous and defiant enough, like you, Keith Mark, and so many of my friends. I have a shit kicker campfire every week in Michigan and Texas, and hardworking Americans in the asset column this is their award. So thank you, everybody. But be sure you tell everybody you know to check out the Ted Nugent Nightly Nuge with Keith Mark and my Real America Voice Spirit Campfire. Because if we are not defiant now, the, the only alternative to defiance against evil is to bend over. Don't bend over, America. And if you believe this stuff, then you have to share it with your friends and welcome them to the Nightly Nuge. Well, you know what, Ted? The rest of the week... Um, I want to talk about what's going on in America with you. Really, I've kind of themed this week the destruction of America. You hit some of those points already. So when we come back tomorrow, which is going to be happy birthday, Theodore Nugent, um, I want to talk about some of the ways America is being systematically destroyed. It's topics that we've talked about before. 
but I don't want to taint today in any way, shape or form. That's an incredible honor for you, Ted. Um, and on behalf of myself, who uh, I consider your friend um, and all of the rest of the people that get to spend time with you or watch you on stage or feel like they know you because of conversations just like this. And you're a real American uh, campfire as well. I, I mean, this is so special and we all are so very, very proud of you, Ted. Uh, enjoy the moment and enjoy your day as you lead into your birthday tomorrow. And we'll come back tomorrow and we'll go through with this theme of the destruction of America. Ted, have a great evening. And my, my friend, congratulations. Thank you very much, Keith. God bless real America. I love all you people in the asset column. Make sure we prod and inspire everyone in our lives to be in the asset column for law and order, God, family, country, and the great American dream of being the best that you can be. Thank you, Keith. 